Microwave communications are a huge and very important part of everyday life because that's how we get all of our data from one point to another when we're talking about cell phones, we're talking about Wi-Fi uh, and a lot of the Internet of Things services, uh, GPS, all of this is running on the microwave bands and without it we really wouldn't have the world that we are so familiar with. So microwave operation generally applies to uh, operations in all the frequency bands above one gigahertz. And as amateurs, we have access to frequencies in the range or in bands from 1.3 gigahertz right up to 240 gigahertz. Microwave frequencies have their own challenges, of course. A lot of those are in the design and construction. Circuits are a lot more sensitive to how well they're produced, how well they're manufactured, and also just uh, the physical tolerances when you start talking about a millimeter being an appreciable fraction of your wavelength. The sort of activities that we do, obviously today we're contesting, um, just trying to get into co contact with as many people as, me as far away as possible. Uh, there's also the amateur TV stuff, which is very popular on the microwave bands. And of course EME, the Earth Moon Earth Moon Bounce. A lot of interesting stuff is happening in the microwave bands now. I, a lot of cutting edge digital signal processing, and building techniques are sitting there, and it's stuff that we haven't had access to in the past. So we're seeing that trickle down from industry, and the home operator can now get stuff that 10 years ago would have only been a dream. Operation in the microwave bands can be particularly uh, demanding, but also particularly satisfying. This is because there are many challenges to be overcome in terms of operating, equipment design, equipment build, and so on. In addition, there are propagation effects that are not yet fully understood, and these can also be investigated by amateur operation in these uh, very high frequency bands. There are awards and firsts that are yet to be achieved, so this could be new territory for amateurs to move into.